Hey, what's up? I'm here to share with you today this case that I got. Um, I would call it the cassette case for the iPhone 4. Uh, let's start off with the material. It's, it's rubber, so it would protect your iPhone from uh, normal bumps here and there. Alright, so this is my iPhone. Let's try to put it in. Easy enough? Okay, so um, at first glance, from far away, you would, you wouldn't actually think that this is an iPhone I'm holding. It looks like a cassette, an actual cassette case. Um, you know, as you've seen, it's it's an iPhone case. Um, I got this for cheap. It's like ten dollars uh, at this website. Uh, I'll tell you about later. But um, yeah, I mean, this is pretty cool. It's unique. It's different. Uh, first case I have is an Incipio. Uh, Incipio thermal soft case I think which is this one um, and as you can see it's pretty boring it's all black no graphics or whatever it's just the Incipio um, logo here so this one is definitely uh, an upgrade and it's cheaper too um, only con I have uh, I noticed in here is that there is no cutout for the 30 pin connector um, luckily it's easy to flip out and flip back in so you know at the end of the day before you sleep you need to charge your phone like always just um, put it out like that but yeah that's that's like a big drawback for me I guess that there's no 30, 30 pin cutout so speak, speaking of cutouts um, there's two for the speakers here uh, it's pretty okay you can see the speakers uh, there's a cutout for uh, the mute switch here and you can easily switch the, the iPhone from mute to or un, to unmute there's no cutout for the volume buttons but you know it doesn't need a cutout because you can still press it uh, no matter what there's a cutout for the uh, the speak I mean the the headphones and there's no cutout for the sleep and wake button, but again, like the speaker buttons on the side, you don't need a cutout for that because you can press it uh, to, to uh, wake up your iPad or your iPhone or put it back to sleep. Um, let's see. Oh, yeah, camera and flash cutouts. It's pretty okay. It doesn't cover the camera or the or the flash, so no problem with that and then there's an opening here I'm not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing I guess it's a good thing for um, cosmetic issues because you know it's mimicking a cassette tape so a cassette tape has holes in here um, uh, but I'm not sure as far as protecting your iPad I mean your iPhone uh, with these holes because it might you know it's it might be prone to scratching but otherwise, uh, this is again the cassette tape for I mean the cassette case for the iPhone 4. I uh, actually like it. And like I said, I got it for ten dollars, so it's a really good bargain. Uh, good product for a bargain price. I got it at this website called concreteviolet.com. Uh, concrete like you know the, the concrete pavement and violet like the color. So it's spelled C O N C R E. T E V I O L E T dot com. Uh, I think that's about it. I mean, if you can, uh, if you check the website and they still have it in stock, I would definitely uh, snag one. I mean, it's ten dollars. It's cheaper than your average lunch money. Um, but yeah. So thanks for watching.